the precentral gyrus, which may also be called the primary motor cortex or, most commonly, the motor strip, is a prominent structure on the surface of the posterior frontal lobe. It is located immediately anterior to the central sulcus. It controls the voluntary movements of skeletal muscles. The cell bodies of the pyramidal tracts are found on this gyrus. The axons travel inferiorly, most crossing over in the brain stem, others in the spinal cord, forming the lateral and ventral corticospinal tracts. Transcranial motor evoked potentials, MEP, is the modality used to monitor the integrity of these structures during surgeries that place them at risk for injury. The central sulcus is a prominent landmark of the brain, separating the parietal lobe from the frontal lobe and the primary motor cortex from the primary somatosensory cortex. The postcentral gyrus is a prominent gyrus in the lateral parietal lobe of the human brain. It is the location of the primary somatosensory cortex, the main sensory receptive area for the sense of touch. Like other sensory areas, there is a map of sensory space in this location, called the sensory homunculus. Somatosensory evoked potentials, SSUP, is the modality used to monitor the integrity of these structures during surgeries that place them at risk for injury. The right side of the body is picked up on the left cortex, and the left side of the body is picked up on the right cortex due to crossing the fibers in the medulla. Branches of the middle cerebral artery provide most of the arterial blood supply for the primary motor cortex. However, the medial aspect, the leg area, is supplied by branches of the anterior cerebral artery. The main blood supply for the postcentral gyrus is from both the anterior cerebral artery and the middle cerebral artery. However, the medial aspect of the postcentral gyrus, the leg area, is supplied by the anterior cerebral artery. When the cortex is at risk for injury during tumor resection surgery, identification of the central sulcus with SSUP is the first step toward preserving neurologic function. A grid of usually six recording electrodes is placed directly on the brain and SSEPs are recorded from regions both anterior and posterior to the central sulcus. SSEP waveforms invert when recordings are made anterior to the central sulcus. This is called SSEP phase reversal.